We're trying to build a school that kids will want to come to, that they're excited about being at, they'll focus on their learning, but they're also safe to learn. This is the most exciting school I've ever heard of. It's everything I've been trying to do and implement in the classroom for the last 10 years. It's the culture where our, our kids feel safe. They're safe to get outside the box. I've never had that much fun building anything. I mean, it's the first time I've seen so many tools in one place and so many teenagers using it. It's easier to be thinking outside the box if the sides of the box aren't so high. Imagination plus fabrication leads to innovation and expands the human spirit. And that is why this school is so worth whatever can be put into it to enable those skills and those excitements and those imaginations to come true. The STEM Revolution Capital Campaign to raise a million dollars is important because we need the facilities, we need the classrooms, we need the labs, we need the science equipment, the engineering equipment, the computers, the software, the printers, and the multimedia devices to provide the hands-on experience required of students that are preparing for college education and future careers in STEM-related fields. I'm very attuned to the idea of bringing up a generation of young scientists. After I graduate from STEM in high school, I'd like to move on to a college, an engineering college, and I'd like to pursue a double major in mechanical engineering and aeronautic engineering. We need actual replacement because you know, like 15, 20 years later, we become retired and we need somebody to replace us. When I grow up, I want to be a mechanical engineer on the fact that I get to play with all my tools still and I still get to play with laptops. It takes 25 years to make a scientist. The vision of STEM Academy is to be a community resource, not just a school, where we can open up our doors after school to all the kids in the community. The thing here at STEM that I like best is definitely the Academy. The reason is because the Academy is really what helps me become challenged in the areas that I want to be challenged. I'm kind of heading towards chemists astrophysicist or robotics. I'd probably maybe be someone who works in the astronomical field or someone who works in the mechanical engineering field. I want to become a cardiovascular surgeon when I grow up, so I'm hopefully going to graduate in-state and then go to an Ivy League school for medical school. At STEM, I'd like to go to an Ivy League college and get a, ma a business major and then go on to become a CEO. Now, if I choose to become an aerospace engineer, then my dream would be being able to design a rocket that can safely get astronauts to far off planets such as Mars. If it's something that really excites you as a student and a couple of other kids, you can do it. It's wonderful. It's amazing and I don't think there's any place else that is doing it that way. But boy does it work. We want them to be inspired and uh, enriched and, and their educational experience enhanced through the mentors and through all the community resources that we offer at STEM Academy. I got a lot out of it. I do my job better because I'm mentored. Uh, there are assumptions I work day to day and working with these kids, I'm forced to evaluate these assumptions and explain them. I do my job better because of it. Both engineering firms, Lockheed, ULA, these guys have been a huge support to us, um, both funding-wise and just as a, as a support in our community. For students to be able to work on complex um, code and, and software and hardware and, and all these things that come together in such intricate systems, uh, there, there's no way these students could do that on their own without the guidance and mentorship of, of both the employees of the companies as well as the, the donations that those companies make. Our business has a vested interest, you might say, in the long-term uh, promotion and encouragement of STEM education. The school continues to win different awards in math and science. Uh, for a first year, it doesn't get too much better than that. At STEM, we want to prepare kids for jobs that don't exist yet. To do that, we really need 
kind of, we need the state of the art modern equipment. We need help. <laughs> we need to buy tools. We need to buy good tools to, to put in these kids' hands so that they can really, really explore what their interests are, that they can really develop these skills. I would just like to say a really huge thank you to every single company that supported us. As a parent and an innovator, I would challenge other parents and industry leaders to invest in STEM education so that America can maintain its global leadership in the areas of science and technology.